Damn. Okay. So what is the relationship like between y'all at this point? Because clearly y'all ain't staying at the hotel. I mean, at the, at the crib, the, the $10,000 a month mansion, y'all got to stay in the hotel, even though you was in a suite, but you're only there in Miami for a few days a month. He's down there for three straight months. Is there friction in the group? Um, are y'all talking at this point? Are y'all best friends? Like, what is the relationship like? I mean, at that time, we was, we was cool. You know, at that time, we, we were cool, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, still not, it's still not, it's still not coming in clear yet. Everything that come in clear to 2005 when we broke the group up, to me, it still wasn't coming in clear. You know, I'm still cool. Cause I'm a type of person, if I say you my brother, you my brother, you know? And I'm gonna ride that till the wheels fall off until you mess that up. But yeah, we all, man, put it like this. Every time we went down there, I can tell you right now, we went down there for the uh, BET How I'm Living. We did that down there. And um, and they were trying to, do, they were like, hey, man, one of y'all can use my room if y'all want to. And I'm like, nah, bro, I ain't doing that. <laughs> I, no, I ain't, I'm not acting like I stay here, which y'all know. I'm not doing that. I ain't fake like that. No, nah, we ain't doing that. And um, MTV did something that we was down there doing and stuff like that. But it came, matter of fact, it came to me and Bo. They they came to me and Bo and said, hey, MTV want to do MTV Cribs on y'all. We like, bet, let's do it. So I'm at my house. I'm, I'm like, I'm finna get this set up. The guy that cut my grass, I'm telling him about it. He said, oh, man. Let me know today. I'm going to come cut the grass. I'm going to have on a tuxedo with the penguin. Like, I'm finna make mine funny. I'm trying to be better than Red Man. I'm finna make mine funny, right? Mm -hmm. So they come back to us like, ah, yeah, they, they ready to do it. They say they're going to get y'all a, a, a condo downtown where you and Bo going to be in the, you and Bo going to stay in the condo downtown. And we, me and Bo said, hold on, man, hold on. What we look like staying in a condo downtown together? Bo like, man, I'm married. I got kids. That man married. He got kids. What are y'all doing? They were like, no, nah, we're going to. like, bro, we don't want to do that. We don't do that fake stuff, man. Like, we don't want to do that. If y'all don't want to come to our house for real, then we don't want to do it. So we didn't do it. We didn't do it. Damn. But the crazy thing is that was the norm in the music industry at that time. Um, it wasn't just y'all. So but much like MTV cribs. Those was fake cribs. A lot of the fans. I didn't know. See, we. With us, we don't kiss ass. We're not fake. That's the whole thing. We're not fake. And that's another thing about John. He had a lot of people around him that kissed his ass, a lot of yes men. We wouldn't know yes men with, like, I'll cuss him out. I'll tell him when he, he doing something wrong. I would cuss him out. I didn't care. You know, I, trust me, I didn't care. He know it. I would tell him how I felt. I didn't care. You know what I'm saying? What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.